These people are participating in an immersive dining experience at London Food Tech Week. So it's kind of a surprising idea to many people that the sounds that you hear, say from your mobile device, could change the taste of the food, just like the salt and pepper shaker could. Gastrophysicist Charles Spence says this so-called sonic seasoning, as well as looking at colorful images of food and smelling fragrances, will enhance a meal. But in fact, we have a growing amount of evidence now from the psychology lab, from chefs, artists, composers, uh, to demonstrate that we can create music or pick music off the shelf that uh, will bring out sweetness, that will bring out saltiness, sourness, bitterness, creaminess, spiciness. In an Oxford study a few years ago, researchers found that seafood really tasted better when eaters listened to sounds of the ocean. Improving the dining experience is possible in other ways, such as by telling stories about the origin of the ingredients. Celebrity chef Jamie Oliver's company has set up a chatbot on Facebook. Customers can select an emotional emoji and get a recipe appropriate for that feeling. The chatbot experience teaches us that no matter how simple things are, people need to just get to the content as quickly as possible, and keeping it simple makes it a lot easier to do that. Um, augmented reality, we see a bold future in that space. Um, we've always been about helping people be better at the things that they love doing. The focus of London Food Tech Week is driving innovation in the food tech industry. Food is one of the least disruptive markets in terms of new business models, in terms of technologies and innovations out there, yet it's got serious global challenges within it that actually once we start to apply technology to it, we can start to change some of these for positive um, in a commercial uh, and scalable and repeatable way. <laughs> this is the third year Why Food organized the event. The exhibitors and investors hope the technologies featured here will help transform and define the future of the food industry. For writer Faisa El Masri, I'm Faith Lapidus, VOA News.